Hey, what's going on, everybody? Exhaustive Gaming here, bringing you an unboxing video of the Fusion One Tournament Xbox 360 controller from Power A. Um, I picked up this controller yesterday from Best Buy for $51.99. Um, as you know, Power A is now making accessories for the PlayStation 4, as well as the. Um, I think they're making something for the Xbox 360 as well. But um, I picked this controller up because I like gaming with a controller on my PC with games that allow it and games that w it works really well with so um, I already have one for the PlayStation 3 which I've had for a good year or so right now but I just like the form factor I really didn't like the Xbox 360 controller just because that you know the thumbsticks and just some things about it just really nagged me but with this controller with with the Fusion 1 controller um, Power A really took the Xbox 360 form factor and made it a great, great package. So, let's see. You can see right here. It's a tournament grade controller. It has um, the cycling LED lights. You can change the lights and everything. So, let's go ahead and look on the back. Well, right here it includes the Power A Fusion controller. Comes with the Fusion controller with a protective travel case, soft touch grips, mat grips, cord wrap, and mini screwdriver. So that's for you to change the uh, the grips on the controller as well. So we're gonna look here on the side. And as you can see, it has the perfect analog control, finally two modules to improve accuracy, unique analog stick design, reduce thumb fatigue by extending during extended gameplay sessions um, precision d-pad they made the d-pad protrude way more so it'll be great fighting games as well um, durable action buttons high quality materials improve accuracy and longevity let me zoom this in a little bit and then we have the um, high performance triggers which are basically top-notch the best I've seen it so far and it comes with a braided 9.8 8-foot cable, 3-meter cord, wired for tournament play, and, and um, is within regulations for the tournament. So, as you can see here, these are the different color LEDs that this device can change to. We look on the back. That's just the stuff on the back. The right side, you see how it looks. So, let's go ahead and get this thing out of the box. Alright, great packaging from Power A. And as you see here, it comes with everything in here, the, the Fusion 1 toolkit. So it includes soft touch grips, mat grips, mini screwdriver, quick start guide, and user manual. So let's go ahead and get that, get this open real quick. So, alright. Alright, as you see here, it comes with... Um, the, the second set of mat grips for the controller. These are the mat grips right here, which about provide you with more grip while you're playing the game and keep your palms from getting sweaty. Quick start guide. User manual. And it also comes with some um, high quality stickers that you can decorate however you see fit great quality stickers this is probably like my third set of stickers just another piece and then right in here I'm not going to take these out but as you can see the grips of which I'll be able to show you on the controller it comes with your screwdriver these are the front and the back grips so alright let's go ahead and get to the controller real quick All right, here you have the controller come in a great, nice, nice, tough, durable case. Let's go ahead and unzip it. As you can see right here, it has a carrying handle to it. Great, great quality. Embroidered with the uh, Poway logo in the front. Alright, as you can see, this is the controller right here. Comes in great, great packaging. Here's the controller itself. 
as you can see, is really, really well built. And one thing I wanted to point out about this controller is that the thumbsticks are a little bit raised, a little bit higher, and they're a little bit wider than the thumbsticks you will find on the stock Xbox controller. So that's good for first person shooters and getting a wider range of motion when you're playing the games and stuff like that. I've been playing this with Titanfall on the Titanfall beta last night and I loved it every every single bit. So here are the triggers. Great reaction to almost a mechanical like feel to them. The bumpers. And then right here, if you can see it, this is where you change the light for the controller so and right here are the screw holes right here if you can see them where you can remove the uh, grips on them and change them out and of course at the bottom you have your your microphone output so you can use a headset with it also let's get to the cable again I'm not going to unwind the cable but it's a nine foot cable braided cable high high quality. Let me get this in focus. High quality cable comes with a um, with a tie, a nice neoprene tie that can you can you know manage your cord management as well. So I really like this controller and it, the packaging, the carrying case for it is great as well. So I'm going to put this over here and I'm going to bring out my PlayStation 3 one. And this is my PlayStation 3 one right here, which I've been using ever since this controller came out. I got this probably back in like, um, I want to say 2012. Yeah, I got this in middle, late 2012, and I've been using it ever since. So great, great controller. Served me well. It just doesn't have some things like the 361 does. The, um, microphone output but everything else is practically the same so you see them side by side they did a great job with bringing the form factor of the original 360 controller Xbox 360 controller and making it for both the systems PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360 which you know I could have used this one on my PC but I would have had to go find software to run it and all that when I can just get this right here and it's plug and play because it's a 36 X it's a Xbox 360 controller so it works like a charm and this one is here well you can see is breakaway it well it's not a breakaway cable here it's USB this one has the USB as well but it also has the breakaway I think it has the, yeah, the breakaway right here so if you have to disconnect it can disconnect like that so all right, I'm going to get it plugged up and everything and show you how it looks with the uh, when you can change the colors and stuff like that. So I'll be back shortly. All right, everybody, Exhausted Gamer back here. I got the controller plugged up and everything. So I just wanted to show you a quick demo of the color changes. So first, when you hit the button in the back, start off with the red, green, blue, purple, um, probably like a turquoise color and that's it back to off so it has every function of the Xbox 360 controller perfect for PC gaming especially if you're gonna be playing shooters and action games and stuff like that and you really don't want to have to use the keyboard and mouse all the time this is a great controller um, I got the last one as you can see right here that came with the box um, from my Best Buy that came with the uh, carrying case and everything. I guess Power A decided that since the Xbox One was out now, Xbox One and the PS4 was out now, there was no need for them to spend the extra money in making those carrying cases for this device. But they do have it in a smaller, they come in a smaller box and everything with just, just the controller. And the you know the grips where you can make the changes and stuff like that. But I really really like this controller and it's perfect for gaming and it's very durable. So I don't recommend throwing it off a wall. But you know it's great for your gaming and it has that mechanical keyboard feel to it as well. With the great raise the the buttons on here are raised as well, so you get a quicker response out of your buttons and everything like that. So all right. Just been exhausted gaming here, bringing you this unboxing. Y'all take care. Peace.
Hey, what's up, everybody? Um, Exhausted Gamer back here again. Just wanting to show you a quick uh, demo with me using this controller with uh, the Titanfall beta. Um, if I'm not if I'm not mistaken, the Titan Titanfall was developed for consoles and basically, you know, put on the PC as well. So everything works perfectly when you're scrolling through all the menus and everything like that. So up and down, no key bindings needed. So let's go ahead and hop into a quick game just to show you how this works. I'm going to hop into a, a quick game real quick. Alright, we're just going to do attrition. If you're wondering, by the way, I'm playing on a 27-inch Asus uh, MX, MX279 monitor. So, pretty good monitor. Let me get it up here a little bit. Pretty good monitor. I liked it so much, I actually got another one for my PlayStation 4 and my PlayStation 3. So, this is the one I use for my computer. And I have the same one okay, for my PlayStation monitor. So, all enemy forces. let's go ahead and get this started. We'll start off with... Violence. Let's do this right here. We don't have much time left for a comeback. Pull it together. Alright, as you can see... Might look a little funny for a second because I'm using, you know, got my hand in front of the controller, in front of the camera, and everything. So, but just to give you an idea how it works. Ah, uh, somebody got me. It has a great response to it and everything. So. I haven't changed my sensitivity at all. Everything is on default. How the game came and it still moves pretty good and reacts well. Titanfall, you know, it's probably going to rejuvenate a lot of shooters out there, first-person shooters, because just because of the gameplay, I think, and I think it's just it's, it's a great game. So. here and see if we can catch somebody slipping. Oh, he just got the business. Uh, well, that's just a quick gameplay. Just want to show you guys I hopped in probably like mid-match on this one or so, but I re definitely, definitely recommend you know, picking up this controller if you're going to be doing PC gaming and you want a good controller, this will be a great controller as well to pick up. So that's pretty much it for this one. Exhausted Gamer out. Peace.